both Bukhari and Muslim relate in their compilations from Abu Huraira radiyallahu anhu that he heard Allah's messenger sallallahu alayhi wasallam say Indeed there were 3 from the children of Israel the leper the bald-headed man and the blind man and Allah the exalted decided to test them so he sent to them an angel who went first to the leper and said what is most beloved to you he said good color and good skin for the people are disgusted by me the angel touched over him and his affliction went away he was now given good color and good skin the angel asked and what wealth is most beloved to you he said camels or he said cows he wasn't sure either it was the leper or the bald-headed man who said camels while it was the other who said cows he was given a pregnant camel and the angel said may you be blessed with it he then went to the bald-headed man and said what is most beloved to you he said good hair and a wish to be cured of this disease indeed people are repelled by me Then the angel touched over him his affliction went away and he was given good hair The angel then asked and what wealth is most beloved to you He said cows The angel gave him a pregnant cow and said May you be blessed with it He then went to the blind man and said What is most beloved to you He said for Allah to return to me my sight so that with it i can see people then the angel touched over him and allah returned to him his sight the angel asked and what wealth is most beloved to you he said sheep so he gave him one pregnant sheep and the livestock of each one of them reproduced so that the first had a valley full of camels while the second had a valley full of cows and the third had a valley full of sheep then the angel came to the leper in the shape of a man and said i am a poor man who has run out of means during his travel today i will not find that which i need to continue my travel except through allah and then through you i ask you by the one who has given you good color and good skin and wealth to give me one camel upon which i may complete my journey he said indeed the rights of others upon me are many the angel said to him it seems that i know you were you not a leper who people found to be repulsive a poor man and allah gave you he said indeed i have inherited from my forebears he said if you are lying then may allah change you back to your previous state he then went to the bald headed man again in the guise of a man and said the same words that he said to the leper the bald headed man responded in the same manner that the leper did angel said if you are lying then may allah change you back to your previous state he then went to the blind man yet again in the shape of a man and said I am a poor man who is cut off from his journey. Today I have no means for reaching my destination except through Allah and then through you. I ask you by the one who has returned to you your sight to give me one sheep with which I may complete my journey. He said, "Indeed, I was blind and Allah returned to me my sight. Poor and he made me rich." So take whatever you desire for by Allah I will not hold back anything from you today that you take for Allah The angel said Keep your wealth for indeed you were only tested Indeed Allah is pleased with you and is angry with your two companions Collected by Al-Bukhari and Muslim